Oh yeah. Move that. Ho 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 ho. Holiday shopping. Well, that doesn't sound like Santa, but here we are at holiday shopping. Not shopping. Shopping, a game made by Arcade Kitten, the developer of Cemetery Mary and. I kind of forget, it's a spin off of Cemetery Mary 2. Uh, what's the name? Uh, well, well, I'll just link it in the description or perhaps in the card on the top. Yeah, that's more better. So. All day shopping is also a spin off of Cemetery Mary and should only be played if you have already played the original game, completed the original game, and by that I mean you have reached the true ending. So if you haven't, if you haven't played it, or if you haven't watched it, spoiler warning, you better go. Okay, so let's just start playing the game, shall we? Warning, the game content depiction of the following gun, blood, potential murder, language. Okay. Okay. Oh, <laughs> gunshot, yeah. Okay. That is enough. Ah, videos. Long time no see. Don't even try anything. Still looks like the best person ever. Don't make this harder than it has to be. Who are you murdering? Oh, target. No, no, please. Please. You don't understand. So, by the way, this is a prequel to Cemetery Mary. I only joined this business because I was desperate. You, you have to understand that, don't you? Please, I... I got a wife, you know. Oh, that is so sad. But this is my fear business. And, and a kid who... A daughter. She is only five. Y you know? Oh. She'll be six in the spring. Oh. I can leave her fatherless right before the holidays. I can just leave my wife wondering what happened to me. Look. I was desperate, right? But not anymore. I've got money saved. I swear, I swear, 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 if you let me live, I'll live, promise I will live, I will leave this line of business and never come back, my family and I, I'll take them to a new city, find a new job, never touch any of this stuff again, won't even come close to here. We'll just be far away and I'll have a normal job. And we can stay a happy family. A normal happy family. Please, please man. Please let me leave. Come on, Avidius. You're swaying, you know. At, one, at this moment you're considering to let him alive. But the question is, ah yes, what are you doing, Ovidius? You know that he's lying to you. You know that he is. You have seen them do it all the time. It is the same excuse time and time again. Always promising to change. Promising, promising. The same dang sh shrimp. Shrimp, yeah. But he... Stop it. Boss needed his job done. Indeed, he's relying on you. And... You know what it feels like to let him down. I can't disappoint him. Alright, Ovidius. What is your choice? Life is a young age to lose a parent. To lose a parent. Oh, dang it, Ovidius, where's your head at? Enough of this. You know what you have to do. Just do it. Oh, okay, I thought it will be a short story, but apparently... Huh. 
Ding dong ding ding dong ding ding dong ding 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 Christmas me recall which one should I pick? La 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 you know what I'll kinda Yes, there we go. Shuffle and then up down up down up down up down uh any minute no Oh look at that. Actually that doesn't even closing my eyes doesn't help at all because I know if the movement is up or down, up or down like that. Yeah, I'll just say that my conscience told me to not. Break. Listen up. Because I'm not freaking letting my guard down, stand up. Run towards the exit door and never ever come back. Because if I win up in trouble and find out you ratted me out, won't let you go a second time. Because I promise you, I'm really good at what I do. There he goes. The scattering around, scrambling, or whatever it is. We sigh. Let's just hope I don't regret it. Oh, a phone call. My phone. Hello there, boss. Yep. <laughs> I kind of know it. It is boss. I haven't played it. Played it, though. As you can see, the skip button is not on. Ovidius. Weren't expecting you to pick up, if I'm honest. Does that mean you are done? How did things go? I'm sorry, boss. I can lie to you. He got away. Dang it, really? I'm so sorry, I'll make it up to you. Boss, come on, it's Christmas holiday, boss. Sorry, I was just thinking. I mean, I mean it, I'll make it up to you, boss. No, no. I respect your effort. This rarely happens after all. You can just head home for now. We'll figure this out later. If there's anyone else I can trust with this sort of stuff, it is you after all. Of course, boss. Of course. There's no one else I'd rather do it for. Ah, now there's music. Lovely. Home sweet home. By the way, this is a lovely art. Look at that. Look at that background. It... It has its own lovely look and style. I like it. Look at that. The reddish color, the shape. Oh, lovely. Or a uh, apartment suite apartment, I guess. Well, it's a home. Home is where you... Feel where you belong, you could say. That goes the same with family, huh? Isn't it? Do you feel belong in your apartment? Well, even if you're not, that's the only place you could call home for now. <laughs> One of the few places I don't have to worry about running into anyone in the parliament. It's always been safe around these parts. There are security cameras around. And in, in the entire building. And with so many people living right beside me, it is less likely I'll be targeted here. I mean, I've been safe so far. By the way, it's a lovely choice of music. It's kind of relaxing, nice. So I've got to be doing something right. Say, what time is it anyway? Let me check my phone. 4 a.m. already? You're late. I mean, should I really be surprised anymore? It's always late nights with this job. I just couldn't get normal. Uh... There was just a mice passing by my leg. That is very unpleasant. I'll be right back. Okay, I don't think I am able to catch the mouse currently because um, the mice. My whole body hurts. Yeah, I've been trying to working out once again, and yeah, it's it's hurt now. Uh huh? What do I do now? You can all look around the apartment using your RO keys or mouse. Okay, thank you. That is helpful. Oh, Puppy Magazine. Yeah, I want to click that from the start. And it, I can do that. Let's do that. Pamphlet. 
I have had it for a while now, haven't I? A pub for every person. Wow, what, what's with the look of the pub? Oh, I can see the mice, now it's coming out. Wait a minute again. Yeah, it's sniffing around. I think it's blind, I don't know. Stop it, videos, and yeah, we're back. I cannot ca catch the mice again, oh my god. You know, you can get a dog. And in this line of work, yeah, get real. Not to mention I don't even know if we're all with pets. Oh, wait a minute, I forget to silence the voice. Oh no. I'll be right back. Okay, let us continue here. Oh, that must be very loud. Oh no, sorry about that. A dog wouldn't be happy here in the first place. How how would you sure about this one? There's nowhere to run or play and the nearest park is a drive away. <laughs> I shall just draw the draw out this stupid thing already. Oh, shaky. Tomorrow. I'll throw it out tomorrow morning. Let's see. I haven't actually watched TV in a while, huh? Is there anything on? News or play, cartoons, food competition, horror movie. Ah, some good stuff. Eh, I don't know if it feels interesting enough to sit down and watch right now. Maybe I'll check back in the morning. How, uh, how about if you just open some stream, huh? huh? Would be nice. You, you could search YouTube for, uh, I, I don't know, some famous figure like Jack Sepigai, Mark Blyer. Hit a buy. Or, uh. Hero Rose. Yeah, yeah self promotion. Very nice. Maybe I'll check back in the morning. In the morning, eh? If tomorrow does come. Oh, we cannot sit on the sofa. That is sad. Yeah, she'll probably eat dinner, huh? I think it's a bit late to make anything too big, though. Well, as long. As I have bread, I can make some kind of sandwich. Let's see. Wait, are we supposed to go there? Oh no, there's no back button. Oh no. Oh, okay. Well, it wasn't the most feeling, but it gets the job done. I'll at least hold me on. It will at least hold me over until morning. I thought we will go advancing the game. Do I have to use the bathroom? No, I'm alright. I'll probably take a shower in the morning, though. So. I was stinky. I'm just feeling a bit too lazy to take right now. Oh, okay, okay, okay then. It's okay, it's okay. Okay, the last thing to click is this door. Should I just go to bed? I just love hearing the music. Let's go. And another day is done. Oh, it's snowing outside. I did the right thing. Granted, that is it if it doesn't come back to bite me in the uh, in the butt. I must say, Aussie. Still assuming a family should be together during the holidays. Yeah, they should. It is snowing an awful lot. It is good I got home when I did, I suppose. I wonder how much snow there will be to clean up tomorrow. Eh. Remember when Mama used to make me shuffle the snow? Oh. She would trick me into doing it if you call it, could call it tricking. There is an awful lot of snow. No, it's not a grandma. It's a, it's a mother. Wait. There is an awful lot of snow in the dr driveway. You know. I bet if you were to shovel it all up, you have enough snow to make the biggest snowman in the world. Hey, hey. And I always did try to. I was always so convinced I make the biggest snowman in the world had ever seen. But it would always start to melt before I was finished with it. Oh. Avidious. Mama would always decorate for the holidays too. No matter if she was sick. Busy, or handling it all herself. She always made sure, made sure we had nice decoration. The lights were always my favorite. 
She has always used to buy the big, chunky, colorful lights. I think she thought the colorless ones were too boring. And Mama always was a really colorful woman. Maybe I should buy some. Maybe. It's kind of bland in here, isn't it? I can do that, right? What am I saying? Of course I can do that! Oh, It's my apartment, it's not like it's going to bother anyone else. Oh, that's, that's the spirit of holiday. Go pick those Christmas tree Christmas light and everything you have. And start decorating your home with... Socks, cookies, milk, and... Santa Claus if you're able to kidnap one on the street. You know, uh, the funny thing is, before, before I watch this, I kind of watch... The World War II, World War One actually video, and it's not just any World War World War One video. It's the Christmas, nineteen fourteen. It was a truly beautiful moment among the well war, among the. It was a moment where people are reminded of their own humanity. Which is lovely, it uh, makes me grown up man doesn't cry, well, I cried a little bit, but that's a secret, although I upload this video to public so it's not a secret, so let's continue. Besides, I have seen some of the neighbor put up a little decorations, why can I do the same? All these are for family, oh, for families. And I think it will be a nice piece of family to have around. Yeah. Oh, and there we go. It will be nice. Okay, see the mice, it's now climbing up. Sorry. Wait a minute. Ah, what a lovely Christmas morning, isn't it? Huh? My... my phone? It was just my phone. What time is it? Four o'clock in the afternoon? I mean, I guess I did have a long night. Oh, my phone, right. It's... the boss son. What does he want? Carofan, about time you pick it up. I apologize, apologize, apologies. Is everything all right? I need to to come to Pinecrest Pinecrest Mall. Oh, holiday shopping, as the title say. It is important. Important. Yeah, and I need you to look as inconspicuous as possible. What? Why? What's happening there? I don't know. I can tell you now. It might ruin everything. Ruin everything? Jeez, are you just gonna repeat everything I say? Just get here quickly as quickly as you can. See you soon. Wait, what? Crowen, what is happening there? Hello, Crowen. He hung up. <laughs> Typical Crowen. But Crowen, he never calls me. So it must be a really important mission he needs done. In that case, I'll have to get rested as quickly as possible. Uh-huh. Inconspicuously. To be noted. There you go. Oh, yeah, you, you do dress inconspicuously. I thought you will dress like a, an agent or something. It's already dark outside. I hope I'm not too late. Lovely dress, by the way. This... This is where he said to meet him, right? I'm not quite used to <laughs> I'm not quite used to being out like this anymore. Oh. Hmm. Oh wait. There he is. Oh, that's casual clothing. Uh, nice refreshing to see thing to see. He's all by himself. Not really. What's our business here anyway? I'm pretty sure someone will come in a moment. 
I guess I'm about to find out. Proven? About time you show up. Dang, I told you to dress inconspicuously, not like you're ready to go freaking morning climbing. <laughs> I... what? No one's paid attention to me since I got here, what are you even? <clears throat> and what's up with your hair? Looks... stupid. Can you just tell me what you needed me here for? You did say it's important, didn't you? Yeah, it is important. But what is it? What is it then? I'm buying a bunch of gifts tonight and I need help carrying them. Pardon? Yeah, I know it's kinda late to be doing so, but better late than never, right? No, no, no. You called me out here to buy gift? To go whole day shopping? Oh, uh, duh. Yeah. You, you see all this? You see this huge body of uh, videos? This gun? Yeah, well, a video's just not carrying a gun. And also, that huge body can be used to carry some stuff, so I guess Corvin's correct. Let's just go. I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> I got a lot of people to buy for. That mom Mary on... Un sorry. That mom Mary on Uncle Theo and Zap. Ah, oh, Theo and Zap. Yeah. On an Uncle Theo, oh. Harry, yeah, dad and mom, oh. And you couldn't have asked someone else to help you. Uh, duh. You used to it? Of course I can. That ruined the surprise of what their gifts are, yeah. Why not just order it online then? Cause I told you I'm late. Anything I order now will ne never get here on time, even with the fastest shipping. I can't believe this right now. Here I thought it was actually important. Hell, I even thought you might be in trouble. Hey, can you calm the freak down? And did you forget who you are talking to? You know, I'm that son, don't you? Yes, of course, I know that. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's a very quick change of... Uh... Attitude. Yeah, I thought so. But you were talking like you forgot. I didn't forget. So we're really doing this. Yeah, but don't worry. I intend on paying you for your work tonight. Oh, yeah. When we pass by the mall sundown way out, I'll let you take a picture with it. Uh, that's not a pay. <laughs> Great, just what I want. Shame. Oh, I thought Mary will be here, but it's okay. Or perhaps, I don't know, perhaps someone else. Is he done shopping yet? He told me to just wait by the register, but... Register? I feel like it gone done quicker if he just let me help him. That's why he called me in the first place, right? This is really my life, huh? Well, for now I'm just... waiting. Hello! Hello, hey sir. Wait, someone's calling to me? What could they... By the look of your expression, it's someone you know. Oh, oh, hello Twila. Yeah, I just was actually going to say it's Twila, but... Yeah, we do meet Twila. I know who she is. Yeah, you, I bet you knew. She's a member of the parliament, and not just any member. Twila. What is someone like her doing here? Uh, holiday shopping. Uh, and even worse, she's coming right towards me. Hey, sir. You're pretty tall, right? Uh huh. I'm having trouble getting some off a shelf over there. Does she not recognize me? No. You don't mind helping me, do you? You're pretty good at blending in. <laughs> if I think it twice, it's kind of a funny thing because Twyla doesn't recognize Ovidius in this one time, and there's also in the cemetery Mary when Ovidius in the true ending helps bring Mary and Croven from Twila by 
disguising as a member of the parliament, the mafia, who is run by Twila family. Twila also doesn't recognize obedience, which is a little bit funny if you think about it. No, I guess not. I guess not. Yeah. Thank you. Please follow me. Oh, why, why do they have to develop shelf so high? It's right over here. You can reach that, right? This is a discrimination to short people. Shelf are discrimination to short people. Oh, yeah. There you go. Thank you. That wasn't too bad at all. Thank God, I thought I was about to have a real problem on my hands. All I have to do now is get back before Crowvern realize I'm missing. Hey, excuse me, you two. A mall cop? <laughs> what the heck does she want? Is there a problem here, ma'am? Yeah, there is. Oh, security guard. <laughs> the other day, two bandits came and stole something from this store. <laughs> do we look like bandits to you? Two bandits who look suspiciously like you both. You're accusing us. I mean, if you're innocent, you would you won't mind coming with me to the security office, right? This has become troublesome. I definitely mind. If I am around Twyla any longer, she might catch on to me. Not to mention, if this lady really does think we did it and calls the police or something, then... Ray, what am I supposed to do? We don't mind. Don't just answer for me. <laughs> Thank you. Come with me. Rick! <laughs> what? What is happening? <laughs> Come on, no videos. <laughs> it's just Twyla and I in here right now. How does she, she seem so calm about this? Isn't she in the same boat as I am right now? I can't get involved with the police, no way. If those thieves they were talking about stole something expensive, then they are definitely going to phone the police about it. Hell, she might already be doing so right now. Oh, it's raining. I can get interrogated, have all my stuff looked through. What if they get a hold of the boss? Okay, okay. Calm down, videos. Calm down. You are, you are good at what you do. I'm sure of it. And you have never been coughed before. Right? You're just in an unlucky spot right now. But it doesn't mean anything. You're going to be fine. Judging from the situation, I, uh, I don't think so. <laughs> now when that security guard gets back, here's what you're going to do. Excuse yourself to the bathroom. No, that's the worst thing to do. Late for work in the middle of the night. <laughs> as soon as she comes in, you're going to excuse yourself to the bathroom. It's an emergency and you have to go right away. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> You'll be right back, but an emergency like this just can't wait. Before she can answer yes or no, you'll run out of the room promising to come right back. But once you're out of there, You'll probably still look suspicious. Hell, what if she calls order on you? Oh, that is fine if she does. Because I can still evade that situation. And all I have to do is sneak out of the mall. And I could easily do that by... Oh, <laughs> hiding in the getting. Using the train. Come on, using the train is so far. Hiding in the decoration. Getting a new disguise, yeah. I'll go into whatever search they have here and pick out the janitor uniform. I've seen all uniform be left place after place. Surely there's at least one here too. Oh yeah, we're ready for a Santa suit. I don't know, I'm just guessing. I'll just keep my head down and pretend to mop. All the way to the doors. But just making it out the doors isn't enough either. I actually have to get away from the mall. If they are suspicious of me, there's no doubt they might follow me. If that happens, I'll have to get them off my tail. 
but that is the easiest part of this whole plan. All I need to do is... Take a detour, leave the car, drive into... <laughs> no, I don't mean drive into the lake. <laughs> what? A video? Come on, this is... This escalation is... Is very bad. I'll jump out right before it goes over the edge. I've done it before, so I know it's easy. It's just security got intro interrogating you for. <laughs> of course, losing the car is less than ideal, but some things have to be done to ensure the safety of the, of the organization. <laughs> it is worth it. And then after that, all I have to do is get home and I'll be safe. Yeah, yeah. That's perfect. That's gonna work. Of course, I'll have to call up Groven and explain what happened. And uh, that's sure to be an earful. Okay, the mice is sneaking and... I think I can catch it. Wait, wait, wait. Once again, I have failed to capture the mice. Let's continue. Sorry, I had to check in with someone before I called talk to you both. Excuse me, I... Please show us the secret tape. Oh, plan failed. Excuse me, that I wasn't asking permission. Show us the videotape. Oh yes, Twyla being aggressive. Nice. I was about to go through with my plan, but her voice is so demanding. She wasn't even talking to me, and yet I feel like I wasn't listening well enough. Of course, you can see, I have the type right here. It is starting to play. This video... You have to got to be joking. Really? This is a joke, right? Because there is no way you can be serious. What do you mean? The footage show you don't don't know how to do your job. Ooh. Oh no. First of all, the hate gap between the woman and the man in this video is nowhere near as big as the gap between this guy and I. Secondly, this woman is reaching the top shelf with no problem and she isn't wearing any sort of hill or platform. Unlike me who had to ask this man for help. And you know that because you stopped us in the middle of him helping me. Well, you see, and please, you can tell me you didn't see that the guy in this video don't have the same nose shape and this woman eyebrows aren't even close to looking like mine. So what is the big idea, huh? Are you just bored or have a quota to fill? Yeah. Ovidius going with the flow. Trying to get us in trouble right before the holidays. What are you trying to do? Ruin the holidays for everyone? Is that your goal? I... Oh no, poor security guard. I have to go to fetch my superior. <laughs> there you go. Okay, we can leave now. Huh? I said we can leave. But isn't that woman going to come back? I'm not worried about it. After all, we didn't do it. I'm sure this will blow over. It's just a couple of petty mall thieves. Big whoop. So I still stay away from this place for at least a few days. Yeah. Just to be safe. Come on, let's get out of here. I know where the nearest exit is. Oh yeah, silence. Sorry. <laughs> and here we are. Uh, what did you de did back there was pretty impressive. You were entirely cool the entire time, and you were uh, be able to defuse the situation quickly. Well, on our side, at least. <laughs> I mean, of course I did. I knew I didn't do anything wrong, so I had no reason to feel guilty. Wouldn't you feel the same? Ovidius? Oh, ooh, uh, hello. So Twyla did recognize you. So you do recognize me. Well, I admit I didn't know at first. But well, when I started talking to you and you look so nervous, let's just say I asked you to come help me for a reason. And then it was obvious to me who you were. So you, are you the only one here? 
what do you want? Relax, I'm not going to do anything. I mean, after that debacle, you already know this place is crawling with security cameras. Besides, it's not like I planned on meeting you here. I was just... It was just a happy coincidence. That is all. But now that I do have you here, I feel it option to ask. Optional, I think. I don't know what does, does that mean. About a certain little birdie in my family. And what makes you think I had anything to do with them? Oh. Well... Last night my family and I had been expecting someone who never show up. Oh, that person who you didn't kill. We were wondering what was taking him so long when we received a letter. One of our other family member delivered it to us. But it was from the one we had been expecting. He said he was done with this and he was never coming back. That someone inspired him to make a change. And well, that had something to do with you, didn't it? And what if it did? Yes, it did. I thought so. I must say that is very kind of you. Oh, but kindness will, you, will get you nowhere in this business. Well, yes, that's why that person quits. Haha. <laughs> Uh, do you really believe you have helped anyone? Did you go into this line of work because you wanted to help people? That is so funny. You're soft. Just like the rest of that stupid congress of yours. And that will be your downfall. Oh, would you look at the time? So late, I really must be going. But before I do, as a message from my family to yours, I assure you, we'll pay you back for what you did. Well, happy holidays to you too, I guess. <laughs> so I guess I should take a sign of relief. That would have been bad. I'll have to get better at my heading myself and uh, looking less guilty, I guess. <laughs> I like to think I'm normally pretty good at it, but... She caught me off guard. Twyla. Next time, Twyla. I definitely won't get caught. And you're not, actually. When you're dressing up as Mavia. Oh, just my phone. It's Groven. Whoa. Dude, where the freak are you? Uh, outside. Why the freak are you out there? It's a long story. I might need you to meet me out here. Seriously? I called you to help me, not make shrimp harder, shrimp harder on me. I know, I know, I apologize. Fine, fine, whatever. I'll be out there soon. Some help you wear. Oh, problem. Come on, don't, don't be so rude to Avidius. By the way, what? I'm so sorry to ask. I know it isn't right of me to, but if you are gonna say something, then say it. Spit it out already. While you're in there, could you pick up an extra item for me? Really? After you left me in here to carry all this shrimp myself? It's just one thing. Fine. But only cause my dad thinks you're chill or whatever. Thank you, Croven. That's very kind of you. Whatever, whatever. What is it? What is it? Come on. Okay, okay, just a little more and there. Eh. They look perfect. And I think Mama will think so too. Oh, Christmas light. Oh, lovely. Thank you for playing. Happy holidays. The end. Handgun. Oh, prison.com. All right. Incompetech.com. That's a lot. So, that is all for holiday shopping. 
a short holiday visual novel developed by Arcade Kitten, which I have already said from the beginning of the video. Well, uh, in case you didn't know, <laughs> it's a lovely short visual novel, which, well, need you really need to play to really understand all of it. So. But it is lovely, a lovely spin off, you could say. So, see you later then in my next video. Sorry for the late holiday game, and happy holiday. Bye-bye.